says the Lord. They will be caught, says the Lord. Netanyahu, listen to me, Netanyahu. You are afraid of what is happening in Iran. Forget that for a minute. Look to other countries, for Russia has already made a decision. This prophet was caught up and saw the table that they have stood at. This prophet has heard how this dog that is from a junkyard is about to be released and how he will bite viciously. But his attack shall not only be with Iran, but it shall come against Saudi Arabia. But the Lord says, do not worry, because while these cats and dogs are fighting, America shall begin to bloom. America shall begin to prosper. America shall bring oil. America shall bring oil. America shall suddenly see a massive influx of new ideas and creativity. A new energy is coming and it's coming soon, says the Lord. A new energy is coming and it's coming soon. Are you listening to me, says the Spirit of God. So what is the stench? What is the stench that I'm hearing? Hear the prophet today. What is the stench that I'm smelling? What is it? What I am smelling is betrayal. The spirit of Ju Ju Judas and the, and the spirit of Joseph standing together. Judas to take away one, but Joseph, which means to add. And the Lord will add. What am I saying? ISIS is a problem, but it's not the only problem. They have made a plan to enter the schools of America. No, 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 this is a long-term plan. They will enter in and they shall send young men and women and they shall intermarry and they shall raise up families that shall stand and attempt in the second presidency from now. And they shall be called another name then. But they shall attempt to do something in the White House. They have watched all your movies, how the White House has been taken down. And they have dreamed their dreams and I have sat and I have watched and I have left because uh, it is true that they can possibly cripple America for a season and they did but they will never touch Israel for you see Israel has my supernatural protection Israel has my supernatural protection what did the prophet just say to you May I pose a question? Can the borders of Iran, Pakistan, can the borders of Iraq, Saudi Arabia, can they stop Yeshua? No. Now hear me out, says the Lord. Mecca. How they have been fooled and cursed that cursed stone which shall be unraveled and broken in pieces and I speak boldly today from this platform but respectfully Saudi Arabia you kept the oil you tried to deal with Russia God says you did the wrong thing for when you touch my church, can my ecclesia be destroyed? Never. Yes, we know there will be tribulation and so it shall be and my people shall join me. But before that time, there is a global awakening. No, no, not just one town and city, not just one country, but many. Look how I invaded Egypt. You see, most people don't know this, but it was in Arabia that John the Baptist was beheaded. And it is in Arabia and Saudi Arabia shall and has persecuted more Christians than you realize. 
But God, I said, I will now make them accountable. How shall I do this? I will prosper the very country that they hate, calling them the great Satan. New energy is arising. And God says, even though oil shall always be fought after, they shall be burning and burning and burning like you have never seen. And there shall be fights and antagonism, but I cannot unfortunately do it now, as I'm stuck with one who has decided not to fight Islam, not to fight radical Islam, but God said, I will cause a new one to rise up in this nation. And God said, there will be a prophetic anointing that shall carry you until that year. And that prophetic anointing, says the Lord, will bring prosperity to the soil of this country and to the families of this nation. Yes, they have sinned. America is not guiltless. But God said, when I weigh the balance, when I weigh the scales, when I set out the scales, there is great iniquity in Saudi Arabia and all over that region. And therefore, watch with your eyes as the earth shakes and watch how this prosperity comes. For now, I set the prophetic seal upon my house and upon my church to prosper and prosper and prosper even more, says the Lord of hosts. This is a very, very powerful day, night. I know many of you watching all over the world have suddenly been drawn into a whole new episode yes. of prophetic utterance. I'm not saying I'm better than any other prophet. But prophets are now focusing. God said there will be an intermingling, marrying. Terrorism, ISIS coming into the country, luring the girls and the, and the young men. But God said, I told you about the Damascus Road experience. Yes. I told you I'm not going to sit back. If I did it then, I will do it now again. As they are attempting to persecute my church, whom I am building. That's what he says. So I shall once again appear. Blindness shall come. Scales on eyes. And the voice shall say, I am Jesus whom you are persecuting. That day is upon us. But I just heard something, and I know that you watching all over the world just heard it with me. You just heard from this den, God's prophet laying out a plan, entering into a new era of energy. America, listen, fracking and whatever you call it, is going to take place. There is going to be a great supply of oil. Yes. And God spoke this. Yes, many would say, but it's time for America to end now. You would agree with Islam and the Ameri uh, the, Ameri uh, the the terrorist organizations, would you? When you just heard the heart of God, right, right. everyone watching me right now, did you hear God said there are two things that are, are present: the spirit of Judas, which is betrayal to its own nation yep. and to its own people and to its own Messiah, and then there is a spirit of Joseph that has been released. Now you can be a part of this. Joseph means and the Lord will add. I don't know about you, but I'm ready for God to add. I said, I don't know about you, but I'm ready for God to add. Before I do anything else, this drew it out of me. I'd been in all week. I've been, I've been carrying this. And now, and I was carried above the, uh, I was carried above a, a, a table with Putin and, and four others. I did. I saw them writing things which I am not permitted to speak now. Otherwise, I won't be alive next week. I am not permitted to speak this now, but there will come a point when I can share it with the right authorities. And I will do it. And I will do it as I go to Israel. That is my duty. That is what he for you. How seriously you take the offering because starting right from the beginning, there was a fight between two brothers because one brought one that was acceptable. The other had no heart in his offering. And he killed his brother. Today, Lord, thousands of years later, that same spirit is in existence because of greed. I see a king falling. Oh, I see a king falling.
Saudi Arabia, Yemen, Solomon. Lord, you are not pleased. The wall, there's a wall being built that will not be completed for a takeover. Already a plan. Iran, you have wicked plans. Your wickedness cannot be covered. I've seen you, says the Lord. I've already spoken about you. Father, I just pray you'd, you'd stop 